If you've got to record something yourself, whether you're at home or in the office, then I've got 10 tips for you to help get a better result, whether you're using a smartphone, camera like this, or a camcorder. Okay, so the first one to do is switch off notifications. That pinging can be annoying and it could distract you as something might catch your eye that could be pressing. Adjust the angle of the camera. It's much better if it's at eye level rather than people looking up at you. If you have to, put it on a pile of books, but make sure it is stable. Also, if you're putting it on something like a mantelpiece like this, make sure that the phone or whatever you're using won't slide off and make sure it's secure. Avoid having the light behind you and also make sure people are not walking behind you too. Clean the lens. Whether it's a smartphone, computer, webcam or camera, you'll be amazed at the difference it makes. Let your household know you are recording something as you do not want distractions. This can be a problem with pets. Our cat did join in on a live stream. As it happened, it was for school kids and they loved it. They wanted to know more about cats. Do a quick recording to make sure it sounds and looks good. If not, make adjustments and check again. Relax, make sure you do not have anything else on your mind or squeezing it in between Zoom or team meetings. Give yourself a bit of extra time, that will really help. If it is not going to plan, stop, take a break and come back to it. If you're getting frustrated with the recording, your audience will probably notice it. Make some notes, you could type them out on your computer in a large font, bullet points will do. If you are interviewing them, it is useful to have their details so that you can introduce them properly and not leave something out. If you have to redo something, pause for a moment, take a deep breath and start from the beginning of the sentence. If you are interviewing someone using something like Teams, Zoom or Skype and it happens to them, get them to do the same. It will be so much easier to edit later. Finally, how does it look? Check your hair and clothing to make sure nothing is distracting and that nothing is in the background that maybe you don't want there. If you want to know more about filming, photography or some other tech subjects as well, then do subscribe to my channel on the link below or go to my website or YouTube channel and the links are below in the description as well. Thanks for watching, stay safe and see you soon.